All right, welcome to the new moon in March. This is the Pisces new moon. And I always create these meditations because um, the new moon is always a fantastic time to really turn inward. And this ability to turn inward is where, you know, where the diamonds are made. It's where the gold is. So we're going to turn inward today with a couple of different um, meditation techniques. But first, just a little bit about the energies that have come up around this moon. This is the time um, as we turn seasons and as we come up into eclipse season and equinox, there's a lot coming this month. This is the time of really letting go what we don't want. So we have this opportunity to think about, well, it's simple. It doesn't have to be like, okay, I want to spring clean and, and, and get rid of a whole bunch of stuff. And it can be that, but it also can be as, as simple as what don't I want to keep doing in relationships? What, how do I want to show up differently? Um, how do I want to create something that uh, is a really positive habit where I'm maybe doing something on autopilot? Here's like a great example. I was just um, on a just beautiful retreat in Baja and every night they serve this dessert. And this is not something I typically do. I'm not really a dessert person, but I really enjoyed having it. But then when I got home, I noticed every night after dinner, I was now programmed to want dessert. And I was just like, well, this isn't me. This isn't something I want to do on autopilot. So I'm going to just let that go and, you know, enjoy it the next time I'm on retreat or someone offers dessert. Um, but I just, I started it. I didn't quite do a cold turkey. So I just started having like a couple pieces of fruit after dessert or I mean, after dinner. And then I could easily be very conscious about my choices. So that's just a simple, simple example. It's not about denying yourself. It's about making conscious choices. So let's get into the body a little bit here with some, some centering. We'll take the hands at prayer position just right at the heart. And as you inhale, we'll slide the hands apart. So we'll do this a couple rounds and this will balance the two hemispheres of the body and get us kind of into the scene of breath. So we'll inhale and slide the left arm up and the right arm down. And exhale, draw them back together at the heart. Inhale, right arm comes up, left arm comes down. And exhale, bring them together at the heart. One more round, inhale, left arm up. Exhale, back to the heart. Inhale, right arm up, left arm down. And exhale, back to the heart. Good, keeping the eyes closed, get ourselves anchored in. So seeing, sensing, feeling or imagining cords of energy moving down through the pelvis and into the core of earth. Anchoring, stabilizing your energy creating that bond with the earth of safety, of stability. And then imagine that light coming all the way back up through the layers of earth, through the water table, and starting to fill the limbs, the lower limb, the legs, the pelvis, all the way up the spine to the crown, and around the front into the heart and arms. And imagine this light mixing with your own light, the light of yourself. And give it a color. See this color, this earthy color, and the color of you, of your aura, mixing together. And then we'll call in light from the cosmos, from source, bringing that light all the way down this invisible tube that exists above all of us then into the crown. And this light is pure, pure white, so white. And it's just amazing for clearing up what we don't want. So imagine this flowing in through the crown of the head, through the face, all the way down the neck, the chest, the arms, through the core and the pelvis and the legs, the soles of the feet. And then imagine underneath where you're sitting in the earth is a little bathtub drain. 
and it's going to drain through you everything that you don't want. So start to think about it. just, you can even speak it out loud, some things you don't want in your life anymore, some patterns, ways you show up or don't show up, things you do, and just start to maybe speak them in your mind or speak them in, out loud and just start to let them go through this bathtub drain. And just see physically the spiraling action of it coming out below you and into the earth. The earth just absorbing it, transmuting it. It's gone. And then just start to picture more fresh white light coming in from the cosmos all the way down into the body and just flushing out everything again, filling you with radiant and vibrant energy. Okay, then we'll start to get into some breath work here. So as you do this breath work, we're gonna do just a simple four count inhale, six count exhale, starting to brain map or program the mind to have this longer response time so that we are more centered in all of our interactions. <clears throat> I'm just breathing on your own count if it doesn't work to stay in sync with mine. And that's the basis. So it'll be a four count inhale, a little pause, and a six count exhale. And as you do this, we're gonna add in one more technique to keep us really sensing things. We'll sense the expansion of the ribs and the contraction of the ribs. And feel this all 360 degrees of breath. Typically, we breathe more in the front, the anterior side of the body, Start to think about how the side ribs expand and the back ribs expand. And so we'll sink our breath together with an exhale. Letting it go completely. And inhale. Pause. Exhale. Pause, inhale, pause, exhale. Pause, inhale, pause, exhale. Pause, inhale. 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 Pause, 
pause, exhale. Pause, inhale. Pause, exhale. Pause, inhale. Pause, exhale. You can continue with this count on your own or begin to relax the breath and just feel into the expansion and contraction of the ribs. And as you settle into this stillness meditation, anytime the mind wanders, just take it back to either the feeling of the ribs expanding and contracting or the sound of the inhale and exhale.
And keeping the eyes closed, staying really internal with the thoughts, the gaze. Just do a little light blessing that's set to transmute fear and any like really low frequency vibrations or habits. And all you need to do is sit and receive this in that same state, same even breath. And just taking your hands to your heart center and stack one hand on top of the other. Bringing gratitude into the heart, into the body for all that you do and for who you are, how you show up every day. So grateful to have you with me today. Namaste. And we'll send you away with one little thought is how can you be bolder in your life this month? Where can you be bolder? See you next time.